Hello, welcome back to another video. In this video, I'm going to show you how to make a ringtone on your iPhone using Audacity. So if you run our Audacity program, Audacity is a freeware music program that lets you do all sorts of cool stuff to MP3s. I'm going to press on File, we're going to go Open, and I'm going to use Amiga Lotus 2.mp3, and I'm going to press on Open. There we go, it's imported our Amiga Music or our MP3 to Audacity. Now this is all the music and when it's blank I need to remove the blank parts so I'm going to highlight on the end there and I'm going to press on delete on the keyboard. Now the iPhone ringtone needs to be around about 30 seconds or less so let's make that just under 30 seconds. Click on there, drag it right to the end and press backspace on the keyboard and there we go. It's now made it just under 30 seconds. Now I can then use that as my ringtone or I can adjust it to how I like it. As long as it's under 30 seconds you should be good to go. So now I press on file and export to mp3. It's going to go into my music folder, save as Lotus, Amiga Lotus 2, and file type I'm going to select on M4A ACC files FFmpeg. And I'm going to press that one and press on save. Now I'm going to press OK. And you'll see now it's saved it into our music folder. So music, there's our Amiga Lotus. So if I load up iTunes, I make sure my phone's all plugged in. And where it's got on my device, I can click on Tones. And I want to rename this before I drag it in there to Amiga Lotus.m4r. So right click, rename, and M4R. Now I'm using the Mac, it should work on Windows 2. And it says, are you sure you want to change the extension from M4A to M4R? I'm going to go use M4R. And I can then drag the M4R into the tones. So let's drag it in. And we should see Amiga Lotus 2, which is up there. And that is our ringtone. And that's how you create a ringtone on an iPhone using Audacity. You go into your phone now and you can select that as your ringtone. If you found the video of some use, you know what to do. Thumb it up. If you don't like the video, the other button seems to work too. But as always, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.